Hi planner friends, it's Nia. Welcome to my channel. Um, if you are new here, please consider subscribing. Would love to have you be a part of the community. If you're returning, welcome back. Today um, is Friday Night Lights, of course, so I have a few small hauls for you. Petey's here. He says hi, but he would really like for me to focus on him and feed him. Um, that's my update on PD for you. So today I have just a few hauls, small hauls today. Um, I have a small Erin Condren haul. New shop that I uh, shopped with, Podoc Pop. And I have Simply Gilded. I believe it was the fall collection. So I'm going to start with Erin um, Condren because it really wasn't was kind of an Erin Condren order, but not really. So, um, you may or may not know that my, um, folio, like the same day I got it, the string broke. So they sent me a new folio and I had already put my, um, adhesive pocket in the back and my pin loop. Um, and so I had asked, you know, were those permanent or would I be able to move them to the new folio? They said they're permanent. You can't move them. Um, and they weren't trying to send me new pockets and stuff. So I ordered those. Um, actually, though, I was able to move the adhesive pockets, which are these, and... Um, the pin loop. So I was able to pull the ones out of the old broken folio and put them into the new folio. And I was excited about that because this turquoise pin loop is not available. Um, and so I was able to move that and I just think it looks nice with the shimmer pool. Um, so I ordered a couple of adhesive pockets because I have some other folios that don't have pockets in them. And I also have added these to like my academic planner that I use for content planning and business planning. And I also added one to my monthly planner that I use for my budget. So I like them for a couple of different uses. So I grabbed a couple of those. Um, I grabbed the uh, gray, PD says hi again. I grabbed the gray pin loop um, because I thought the gray would look nice with the shimmer pool, which I think still it would. Um, and that was not knowing that I would be able to move my old pin loop over. So got the pin loop. Um, actually got two of them. I have more pin loops than I know what to do with. And then I just ordered like a couple. Well, I ordered one sheet of stickers. So I ordered this um, plaid. I thought this would look cute maybe somewhere around the holidays. Um, holiday plaid seems to be popular this year. And I ordered a couple of covers from the new featured black artists. And um, I would really be remiss if I did not tell you who they were. And I probably don't know. So now I feel horrible about that. Oh, they're in the newsletter. Okay. So, no, they're not. It has the previous artists. I will um, link their info, um, their social media, and their um, names and info in the description box. But um, they have collaborated with five new black artists. I only picked two because I really liked these two and I need another cover like I need a hole in the head um but I wanted to support so 50% of the proceeds go to the artist and 50% go to a social justice cause of that artist's choice so I picked this one as I thought that that was super cute and I got on the bottom be brave um because I think my word of 20 21 is going to be brave. It may be courageous, but it's going to be something, something around there, fearless, something in that realm. Um, so this I thought was cute and perfect for me to use in 2021. And then I just love this art. Um, and this is just the design on both sides. Doesn't say anything on it. 
um, just a beautiful splash of color and abstract art. So I love that. So I got those things from Erin Condren. Um, next is Podoc Pop. P-O-D-A-K Pop. I think I'm saying that right. Um, collaboration with Cookie Sticker Co. And this shop is on Etsy. So there's her info. And so um, if you've ever shopped with Cookie Sticker Co., you know she has the Ankh Washi. And I think she may even have some stickers. So these are charms that I can add on to my planner. And I got the, I think this is white with clear stones. And they look, um, they're more of a, like an AB um, iridescent. So when I look at them straight on, they don't look clear, they look iridescent. So, but I think it was considered clear. And so I grabbed this one, and then I grabbed the gold with clear. And, or it may be gold with gold. I don't know what I ordered, y'all. Um, but I thought these were really pretty, and I thought that they would add cute accent to my half letter planner, which is where I plan to... Um, probably add them on. I could also add it onto my folio. So I have one here on the spine that um, says planner girl. So I could add one on here as well. I think the gold would be really cute to add on and have both of those there. Although that is two different colors of gold. So I don't know about all that, but um, I just thought these were really cute and they were pretty inexpensive. They were like $4 each. So grabbed a couple of those. Always love to support Cookie Sticker Co. And um, this was a new shop to me. And she has some cute things as well. So um, excited to support that merchant as well. Next, we have our Simply Gilded. And I have already unboxed and swatched because, you know, I would know the name of things. So, um, first I'll show you my freebie, which is this sheet. And I'm not sure. Oh, here's my seal. So this is a cute little gold foil freebie sheet and little green seal. And then this is the journaling card that says give thanks. Pretty rose gold. So I love the um, pad folio that we got, I believe, with the June box. I love it so much that I have it put away. So this is the pad folio that came with the subscription box. Um, I did not order a pad folio. She released two more. Um, Petey's back. Um, one was a floral and I just wasn't feeling it. And one was pink and I am not a pink lover. Don't ask me why I bought a pink agenda when I'm not a pink lover. But anyway, I just, I didn't want pink. Um, so she had also mentioned in like one of her stories that she'd be adding more for the holiday. So I'm hoping there'll be something in the holiday collection that I love. I hope she comes out with a black one. That would be amazing. But I just wasn't like loving the, the options. And so I do really like this one. I have a matching um, sticker book. And so I'm good with that. So I just wanted to add additional um, note paper. And I do love this floral um, notepad. And I love the style of these. So um, I grabbed the floral and I grabbed the white with the gold foil. And so I now have some additional notepads. Um, and 
I still have this one that came in the padfolio as well. So um, now it's like I have plenty of paper and I feel like I can use it and I don't have to hoard it because what if I use it and then I don't have any more? That's the type of stuff that goes through my head. Um, so I grabbed that. And then I did not grab a ton of washi um, from the fall collection. I grabbed... Um, I grabbed the tortoise, and let me get you the exact name. It is the classic tortoise shell with light gold bows. And of course, you know, we have the 15 and 10 millimeter. So I thought that was pretty. And y'all, not too much stuff. How pretty is this with my, just knock stuff on the floor, Nia, just knock stuff on the floor. How pretty is this with my half letter cover? I cannot wait. I was waiting for this to come so I could decorate my November month at a glance. Um, I just think those colors with even the caramel are, is just so pretty. So grab the tortoise shell. Um, I grabbed paprika um, in the 15 and 10 millimeter. This also has light gold bows. I was torn between paprika and cinnamon stick and I went back and I was looking online and um, looking at her Instagram photos and I just thought the paprika was more the color I was looking for which was more like a deeper red but not burgundy. So um, and let me show you this rolled out as well. And then I grabbed the November gem of the month, which is citrine. And so this comes in a 15, 10, and 5 millimeter. And the citrine is um, got the, I forget what it's called, but it's like an overlay. Um, so that's what you see. It's not a foil, but it gives that little sparkle to it. So I grabbed that. And here are those three, the citrine, the tortoise shell, and the paprika, all swatched. Okay, and then I grabbed the Fall Beauty um, bundle, and I did not write down these names first, um, so I would need to tell you that separately, um, but I know this one was not part of the bundle. This was the Oops Butterfly, and there's absolutely nothing wrong with this, um, so that's this one up here. There, I don't know what the Oops is. She said there was some spotting in the foil. I don't see it. It looks perfect. Um, then I have this, and I don't know what it's called. So so sorry I didn't write these down beforehand, but really pretty. And then these are books. Um, so it looks a lot darker here on the roll. Um, but these are books, and they're like flipped open with a heart and a um, sort of string connecting them. And so that's this one here. I just think that's really pretty as well. I love books, so these were right up my alley in this collection. And then I don't remember this one being part of the collection, um, but they are sort of like a pastel pumpkin, and they have little gold bows on them. So that's this one down here on the bottom. And then we've got a shelf of books. And that's this one. And so it's hard to tell from that, but here it is. The shelf of books with the flowers above it. And the next one is the Washiception, I think, 2.0. And so this is washi tape on washi tape, which is super cute. And this has some um, gold foil as well. I think it may be rose gold. Then these are like magazines or um, I guess magazines. And so you've got like Chanel and Vogue, Tom Ford and Prada. 
Um, so I thought that was really cute. And that is this one here. And then we've got our coffee chemistry, which I love the coffee chemistry. I think I have all of them. So this is the pink one. Um, and you know, I said, I'm not a fan of pink, but you notice the beauty bundle is all a sort of pink theme. Um, and I love it. I just like, it's just, I don't know. It's the right shade of pink for me. And then I got the black one as well. And so like it spells coffee when it's rolled out. And I think that's super cute. And then, um, SG for simply gilded. I just think, oh, I just love it. It's just so creative. Anyway, so this is what I have this week for Friday Night Lights. Let me know your favorite thing. Um, I'm definitely loving these Ankh charms. Um, and I'm loving the new washi and looking forward to using it in a upcoming spread. Thanks for joining me. Don't forget to hit the like button and I'll see you next time. Bye.